FileWave Inventory allows you to keep track of all the assets inside your environment. All of your assets will have a small FileWave Inventory client installed on them that will report back to the inventory server all of the information for those devices. You can choose from this view to select any of the devices and see all of the details for that particular device and what its usage is. FileWave Inventory will provide you all of the software and hardware details for each individual device. You can choose to see all software and hardware information, including installed applications, drivers, fonts, frameworks, kernel extensions, and hardware information such as RAM and even connected devices. At FileWave, we realize that this is a lot of detail and allow you to build clear and concise reports based on any of the information that you choose to pull from your FileWave inventory database. Building a search based on software or hardware is easy. I'll walk you through a software search from start to finish. So we're simply going to create a new search here and we're going to be looking for an application. In this case, I'm going to look to see how many of my Macs are still running Office 2008. So we're going to select applications and click next. There we're going to go ahead and name our search. And I'm simply going to specify that this is for OS 10 machines. Now we place our search criteria in for applications. Now we know that Office 2008 lives in the path in the applications folder. So the easiest way to search that out is to find items that live in that path. So in this particular case, we're simply going to search that our path contains the word office and the year 2008. So we'll simply say and path contains 2008. And we're also going to want to make sure that they have a full installation of Office. So we'll make sure that there's an application with the name that contains the word. Word. Now that we've set up our criteria, we can test our search and see that we found 12 records. That seems about right. So let's go ahead and save our search out. We can now see all of the devices that are checking in that have that match our criteria. And these are the devices that contain Word. Now you'll notice that the computer names are different. We can either set these manually or as part of the inventory scan from a specific field on the device. Our FileWave inventory will generate a unique ID for each machine. You'll also notice that for our users that have launched Word, we can actually see the number of times they've launched the application, the number of times they've quit the application, and the total time used for that particular application. Now that we've created our search, you'll notice that it's saved over on the left hand side. And of course that the number will be updated as our records change inside of our inventory database. So as we're upgrading our users to Office 2011, we can simply allow that number to twinkle down to zero. And then we'll know that we've gotten everybody in our environment upgraded appropriately. Of course, should you need to export any of these reports out at any time, you always have that ability inside inventory. There's always an option to export that report out as an Excel spreadsheet or a CSV.